sorry guys, that just cut off at the end. I think it's the camera just not responding, but just a few words. It's only going to be 20 seconds now. Um, this this lip doesn't fit in perfectly, so just watch when you do teddy bear fur that it doesn't get way in the way of the join. I think it's just in a few places, but that's 100% my fault. Foreground have produced a stunning kit. For anyone who's interested in the Zulu War, I've got to say this is a must-have. Definitely, that you could even place it a little bit on on some. It's a heavy kit, but I wouldn't recommend you do it. But you could place it a little bit high off the ground, because I think the veranda is a few feet off the ground in in reality, or as it was in reality. And oh, just stunning! I'm absolutely amazed with it. And I think when it's painted, it's just going to be a joy for all the centerpieces of Rock's Drift and the the numerous times I'm going to run through it and perhaps a, a few times the Zulus will man manage to get through and probably slaughter the inhabitants but 10 out of 10 I would say yeah <laughs> I'm totally fanboying over this kit but I'm just amazed at it and the fact that it fits together dry without any glue and is sturdy enough I think in part that's from the sort of jigsaw pattern joins and the way they've managed to do that with the bricks is just stunning Highly recommended, and I'd be tempted to say um, just go for it if you see this kit. And yeah, really chuffed. Okay, guys, that's enough. <laughs> enough of that. Um, catch up with you again soon. Ta da!